two gatherings are planned today at UMass Amherst as the university celebrates the inauguration of a new chancellor while student activist groups prepare to stage a pro-Palestinian protest outside of that event. Twain's news reporter Duncan McLean is live in Amherst with what we expect on campus today. Rich Taylor, Chancellor Javier Reyes will be inaugurated as the 31st leader of the university in a ceremony today here at the Mullen Center that will feature some high profile guests from state politics, attracting the attention of pro-Palestinian and anti-war groups here on campus. Featured speakers at the event include Governor Maura Healey and Representative Jim McGovern. Student activist groups have planned a protest outside of the Mullen Center here, calling for the demilitarization of campus. The social media post promoting the event is captured no business as usual. We have nothing to celebrate until Gaza is free and UMass is demilitarized. Last month, hundreds of students, faculty, staff, and community members staged a walkout on campus, the latest in a series of events over the last year or so here, calling for the end of UMass's partnership with so-called war profiteering organizations, specifically Raytheon, and demanding reduced disciplinary action against 57 people that were arrested at a similar demonstration last October. In the next half hour, I'll detail the history of that partnership with Raytheon and why it's attracting the ire of these groups here on campus. We'll keep you updated as things develop here in Amherst on air online and on the 22 News mobile app as things unfold this morning and afternoon. Working for you live in Amherst, Duncan McLean, 22 News.